Hi guys! So today I wanted to do another Dollar Tree haul. It's going to be a small haul. I just picked up a few things and I would like to share them with you. So let's get into this haul. I bought some of these Reese's peanut butter cups. I bought four of them. They're just the regular uh, peanut butter cup. And you get five in here. And they're snack size. I thought this was not a bad deal. I picked up four for my children's Easter baskets. Um, I already have one in my daughter's Easter basket. And I also found the white chocolate Reese's. These are my favorite. I actually bought five, but I ate one. And one was for me because I'm not making my own Easter basket. So I found the white Reese's. And then for their Easter baskets as well is these Russell Stover's Peanut Butter Chocolate Bunnies. And I bought four of them. Again, because I'm also making my husband a basket. Well, for the boys, I'm not really doing a basket. I'm just basically going to put some candies together and put it like in a cellophane bag or one of those plastic bags. But for my niece and my daughter, I am making Easter baskets. So... I got four of these. Also, um, the Dollar Tree usually brings out different flavored teas. And I, I don't know if this is a Dollar Tree brand. Uh, anyway, I picked up this tea here. This one is in Peach and Passion. You do get 20 tea bags. I'm interested to see if this really tastes good. So I picked up the Peach and Passion. I picked one box up. And then I also picked up this one that's a mango and strawberries. And you get also 20 tea bags as well. And for my teas, I like to have sugar in the raw. So I picked up a box of the sugar in the raw. And you get 25 packets of the sugar in the raw. Uh, this doesn't expire till 11, 28, 21. And then these teas don't expire till 1, 20, 20. So these will last for quite some time. But I like to drink tea, especially in the summertime, and I make like iced tea. So I'm sure we'll be done by those by then. So I picked up this metal wreath ring. I just bought one. I want to work on a wreath. I also picked up some little bunnies. I was eyeballing these for the longest, and I always say, I'll get them next time. I'll, I'll get them next time, every single time. And there was only these two left, and I said, uh, I think next time is today. <laughs> so... I picked these cute little bunnies up. Look at how cute they are. They're so cute. They are so cute. Can you guys see how cute these are? Look at that. This one's holding an egg. And then she's holding a little basket with eggs in there. Oh, they're so cute. All right. Moving along. I picked up this eyeglass repair kit. And... I bought two boxes of the tissue because we are suffering with allergies and it's just crazy so I know that um, we're going to need tissue. So yeah, I picked up two of these boxes. They have the lotion in them. So they're soft. I like them so I will be going back and getting some more. I found the book that I've seen people hauling, this Empire book. It's the unauthorized untold story, but I still got it because it looks interesting. It's just a dollar. Oh, Terrence Howard, he's so good looking. Look at him. Oh my goodness. Anyway, um, Cookie, Taraji. Yeah, so uh, I, I'm interested to read the stories and everything that they have to say here, but yeah found the book. I'm excited that I found it. So I will be reading this tonight. Something that I haven't seen at the Dollar Tree before are these incense. Uh, they're the Centronella. Oh God, I don't know if you guys can see them in frame. Let me show you like this. Okay, so you get six in a pack. Get it. Oh, right there. Okay, so you get six of the Centronella incense. They're for outside in your patio. Can you guys see them? This is what it looks like, the package. And then there they are. I know the lighting is horrible. I'm in my husband's office and 
we have a mess everywhere we have boxes everywhere and just because we're we're going to be moving like in a couple months so there's nowhere to film everywhere is just a mess so yeah but this is i picked up two of these since we're going to be in the new home for the summer and i figured we can use these to keep those bugaloos away so hubby went to the dollar tree with me and he's so stressed out with work and everything else going on and I told him I have to buy you this because we're coffee drinkers so I figured he can put this in his office I thought it was so adorable it says I need a mocha Valium Xanax latte it's a little like a little wooden plaque that has a little stand for the back so you can just stand it like this so I thought that was really cute and he goes oh definitely he goes I will put that in my office so I got that for hubby. Uh, the other thing that we did pick up are these coffee candles. I've seen everybody hauling them. I had seen them at my Dollar Tree. I hadn't picked them up, but today we were there and my husband liked the way they smelled, so I picked them up. So I picked up all four scents that i seen. I saw the white chocolate frappe, frappe or frappe or frappe, however they want to call them, I'm not sure. Frap, I don't know. But white chocolate frap, frappe, or frap, however people say it. Uh, and then I also got the ice caramel macchiato. You don't get a lot, but you can really smell them. Just Even just like as I took them out of the bag, you can smell them. They're really strong, so I'm sure they'll have a decent throw because they do smell pretty strong. I also got the salted caramel frap, or frappe. And then there's one more, mocha frap. Now to me, this one and the white chocolate frap, frappe, they smell like burnt co coffee to me, but my husband says, no, they don't smell like burnt coffee, so he liked the way these smell, so I got these for him mainly. And then I liked the way these smelled, because they smelled, uh, they were m subtle, they weren't as strong as those. So the salted caramel frappe and the iced caramel macchiato. So that's that. And today is extremely windy here in Vegas. And there's uh, power outages. Trees are falling everywhere. It's really bad windy here. So I went. That was the main reason why I went to the Dollar Tree today was to get batteries. I got a whole bunch of these seized batteries for my um, battery operated candles. Just in case we have a power power outage because I know that on the other side of town they did have a power outage and as we were going to the Dollar Tree there was areas where you could see it was all dark and even some of the the lights the um what do you call them the oh goodness the street lights and all that were off so I want to make sure that we're prepared so I'm going to go ahead and as soon as I'm done with this video I'm going to go ahead and put batteries in my candles just in case we have a power outage uh, I picked up some of this piloncillo this is unrefined cane sugar I bought some of this because it is cold so I was thinking of making some champurrado champurrado is just um, like Mexican hot chocolate so I bought that and then hubby bought himself some of this double bubble Chewing gum, it reminds me of the little chiclets from Mexico, but that's what he, he got this bag for his office. And also this one here, the bubble gum, the Frutastic Flavors, three Frutastic Flavors. That's the one that, the other bag that hubby got. And I got this bag. This is where I'm going to put the boys' candies in here for, uh, for Easter instead of making them an Easter basket. This is what they're going to be having their treats in. You get 25 treat bags. I don't need that many, but I am making for a hubby and my boys their bags. So this is something that I hadn't seen ever at the Dollar Tree, and I picked up three packs. Now that I think about it, I should have bought more, but they are these little lights. You can submerge them in water. You can put them in a vase, and they turn on, so they're waterproof. They're pretty awesome. See that right there? That's how they have it inside a vase. So
So I know that we're going to have a housewarming party when we move into the house. So I figured I can use these. I may go back and get some more, but I only picked up three of these packs. That is everything I picked up at the Dollar Tree. I did want to share something with you guys really quickly because I did go to Michael's yesterday. I only bought two things at Michael's yesterday, but they're the same exact thing. But I want to share with you guys so you guys can see. They had these adorable mugs. Do you see these mugs? And it says, all I need is mas mascara, lip gloss, and coffee. Look at how adorable they are. Look at that. Now, normally, they're $6.99, and right now, they're $3.49. So I picked up two. One for my daughter's Easter basket. Look at how cute the little lipstick, like if somebody drank out of it and left their lipstick on there. I picked up one for my daughter's Easter basket. And one for mama, for me. <laughs> They're so cute. So, anyway, that is everything that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. Um, I don't know why I feel like I'm forgetting stuff. I've been going here and there and buying stuff here and there. And I know I forgot some stuff, but oh well. But anyway, that is everything that I picked up at Dollar Tree. I hope you enjoyed this haul. If, if you like watching these hauls, then hit that subscribe button. Anyways, as always, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the next video. Bye, guys. Oh, my God, it's freezing out here. Look at this. It is so windy out here.